And we're back. We are back. We're gonna. T- we are back with another amazing Nirvana lesson from the late great Kurt Cobain. May he rest in peace. We are. This song. I'm just gonna get to it. We're gonna talk about while we are not too happy. <laughs> yeah. Right? Yep. We're gonna talk about why we're not too happy in a minute. Yeah. But I'm gonna also say sorry about the lack of videos. We have two new ones coming up today. So, yes. So, today we will be teaching you also with the late, great Nevermind. From it. Lithium. Lithium is in whole step down yeah, tuning. If you, if you couldn't tell, it's in D standard tuning. I say we just go ahead and say what the strings names are. We yeah. got D, D, G, F, G, C, F, F, A, A, and D. Okay, for now I say we get to while we're not too happy. Yeah, so if you can't tell, I'm a huge Miami Dolphins fan and they just got kicked out of the playoffs. Yes, but, I was going, I was cheering for them, man, I was cheering for them, I wanted to win, it ends up but, that usually stuff does not go the way you want to. But, I'm very proud of them, they played hard, they fought to the very end. The game was rigged! Yeah, if, if anybody watches, like, Buffalo Bills games, and it's in New York, you know those New York refs cheat. Like... But like, we don't, we don't, we're not mad if you do like Buffalo, though. We, yeah, I like if you're a Buffalo fan, there's nothing wrong with that. But the refs, man, they, okay. they miss like six pass interference calls. Now so. we're going to get to the lesson. I guess, should I just tell what's happening? Yeah. I'm going to be the one explaining because this song is full of nuances and stuff. Yeah, it's got stuff that was going to break your brain. You see, he already messed see, up. See, it, it does break your brain. <laughs> First of all, I'm going to say this. Kurt Cobain is probably the best as a songwriter. Just going to get that out. Yeah. One of the best. Yeah, one of the best. I want to say already to hear, this is his signature tuning. Already. Yeah. Just going to say. Signature tuning, D standard. This is Lithium. This is a song that I love. Nathan likes a lot. Yeah. It's not too hard. Probably some nuances in there. That's hard. But it's not as hard as some of his earlier stuff. Yeah. Like on the debut album, Bleach. Um, I can name a couple, but I don't want to, so. That's actually easy. Yeah. Okay, we're going to get to it. I'm going to teach you the first... I'm going to show how he plays it. And then he's going to say what's happening. Okay. Well, quick, if you want to be Kirk Cobain, could like to use only a two-finger paracord technique, but barring the second like, string like that, with his ring finger. Like that, basically. Yes, basically what he's doing. So, I'm going to play the, riff, the first riff. Then we're gonna go into the second riff, the third bri- the bridge riff, which is the third riff, and then the final phase of lithium. Yeah. Which is basically the same except for the ending. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so what that is, is you got the open E string hit that again and go down to that fourth fret power chord and hit the A string yeah hit the E string first and then the A string mm-hmm. and then you do the same thing but on the fourth fret A string power chord and then this you go to this hit the E again and then go to this A power chord yeah he, he picks it like that I like to add the A in there because because it sounds cool. And then that's where we have the first basically strumming pattern. So the strumming pattern is real quick. By the way, he does it hit another open. Yeah. Pattern. He hits another open E before the strumming pattern. Yeah. Right? So the strumming pattern here is a C chord to a D to a B and a 
director again. And, uh, and, uh, before he gets back to the speed, by the way, we're gonna say them like they're in standard tuning. Mm -hmm. He hits the open A. Listening with the ears is very important, like I've learned. Very. Okay. So that's the first whiff. That's what we have so far. I said the first whiff. Yeah. <laughs> I said the first riff. I said the whiff with the W. So that's what we have so far. Now we're going to get through where where he goes. Where when he switches to distortion, he goes. He hits the open E with this riff. It's basically the same thing as the verse, except you're not doing the crazy open E picking yeah. stuff. You're just going. Yeah, like the B there. Like, like the B. He don't hit the open A. He just goes straight to the B to there. Yeah, it's just straight strumming power chords. Strum power chords. The course is easy. Then, then we have the same verse, mm -hmm. same chorus. And then we get. And by the way, in the verse, you could strum it, but that's what not, that's not what he does. Yeah. But you could strum it to just be a little bit more effect like. on acoustic guitar like me you could just strum straight chords yep now i'm going to go to the bridge part which is the easiest part of this whole song yeah so it, all it is is an a power chord to a c power chord back and forth <laughs> Back and forth between that A and that C while he's doing that. I'm not gonna crack. And then when he gets to the long part where he goes, you go D and then B. And then a, yeah, and then a quick O for you know, on the E bend, string. Bend that um, string also a little. Yeah. Not much, just a tiny little bend. And then that's basically the whole song except for the ending. Yeah. It's what is which is which is the same bridge, but he goes. Yeah, that's that. what he does for the ending. And that's the whole song. Well, this song is full of it. Full of a lot of stuff. Full of a lot of chords. Full of a lot of everything. Why would we give this something you should learn as a beginner? No. No. Absolutely not. Intermediate. I don't Intermediate know. for sure. There's a lot of hard stuff though. Like um, I would say probably. Uh, I'd probably say before I would even learn this song, um, I would say one spells like Kane's Fair first. Yeah. Well, th that's um. I hope you enjoyed the lesson. Yep. Really fun doing this. Stay tuned for a coming if you are in Jamie one that maybe either we film today or film next time we see each other. Okay. And we'll see you on the next episode of okay. Guitar Music 24-7. I say we end it with a little song. Oh, okay. <laughs> Take care.